Hi, Coach Finn here. Last video in the, the running series, how to wake up the legs so you can have a better running experience, both for the Boilermaker and in any run you want to do. Last one we're going to do is work on the quads and the hip flexors. Very important if you want to have a nice full extension when you plant off that back foot and help hold your leg forward. If this is locked up, you cannot fully extend. No bueno. So we're going to do something called the couch stretch. It does not mean we're just going to sit on the couch. It's a bad way to train for the board maker unless you're recovering from a run. Uh, you can use a couch though. So it uh, helps to have a pad of some sort, whether it's a pillow, rolled up blanket, an ab mat, whatever it may be. And we're going to start by coming into a, a sort of low lunge position, placing our knee on that pad. So the goal is to get the knee as close to the wall as you can, but if you're closed off and you're needing of more mobilizing, starting with the knee a little bit further away from the wall might be appropriate for you. It's gonna take a little experimenting, but we want the top of the foot to the wall. And then the opposite leg, the foot comes forward. We are now in that low lunge position. I have not opened up yet, I want to uh, make sure that my butt is touching my heel before we open up. And then if, uh, if you're closed off, you can use a PVC pipe to help prop you up. But essentially, once our butt's to our heel, we're going to work on opening up. And if this is as far as we can go, it might be a little taxing, so this is where the uh, PVC pipe or the broomstick can come in handy. And the goal here is to open up the hip flexor and the quad so that we can come fully upright. Once we're upright, depending on where you're at, you want to pulse on that end range of motion. So you're going to bounce in and out just like you were in the other videos. And if you find that you can get all the way back to the wall, shoulder blades come to the wall, arms come out into a cross, and you're going to pulse there. Again, but remains uh, in contact with the bottom of the heel. If this is easy, you can go arms overextended, overhead, pulse in and out. This is really, really, really effective for opening up the hip flexor in that mid and high quad. I promise you it will help with your running mechanics and you'll have a better experience. Do not push too far too soon, especially if you sit a lot for a lot, a lot of people do for their, uh, if they have a desk job, the hip flexors get really short. They get turned off if you sit a lot. So it's going to take a lot of time to open them up, but start sooner rather than later, starting with the couch stretch. Enjoy. Oh, one last thing, 25 pulses per leg, two to three rounds. Now you enjoy.